Hey, what's up guys? Uh, ben here, and welcome to your 13th, ooh, 13th, <laughs> 13th installment of FRC Team 2485 Robotics Java Programming Tutorial Videos. Um, last time we got started with controllers, and we kind of got to see how some of that functionality works, how you can use the joysticks to uh, control the motors on your robot. And this time we're going to end up writing some code for the ratchet um, system in order to kind of make it just a simple interface in order to deal with um, that intake or the, the extending and the retracting mechanism. Um, so one thing that <laughs> I like to do, a lot of people kind of have one button and if you press it once it extends it, if you press it again it retracts it. That functionality, it's, it's around a lot of places, it's just like the one button on off kind of toggle I guess is what the word is. Um, I prefer to have two different buttons, so then, like, if you're in the middle of a match and it's like, no, we're like, extend the ratchet, extend the ratchet, then you can just press that one button, like, as many times as you want, um, and then you can know for sure that it's, like, actually extended this time. <laughs> it's because you want to be like, wait, did I press it or did I not? Uh, so it's like, <laughs> so I'm going to, in this video, uh, use two different buttons, um, and we will see how that works. So the first one, I'm going to go, if controllers and I'm gonna say the operator because the operator is going to be controlling the subsystems if the operator let's say if the operator left joystick button and I'm gonna say like seven is a pretty good button um, if that one it returns a boolean so if that if that's true then we're gonna say um, ratchet dot extend ratchet boom um, pretty pretty cool and then I'm not going to say else if something else. I'm just going to say, well, actually, I should say, yeah, because you don't want to have, if you press both buttons, let's say extend ratchet is like the best option. So if you press both buttons, then you want to extend the ratchet. So I'm going to say else if, so the extend button, the number button seven can override this one. Say else if controllers get operator um, right joystick button and that is going to be uh, number eight because that's remember I said the two button functionality so that's uh, <laughs> a lot I don't know I like that a lot more maybe you don't if you want to toggle that's fine you can do it it's your robot um, ratchet uh, retract ratchet boom and that with that we have a pretty simple functionality for the robot that you press the button once and it extends the ratchet and you press it again and it kind of retracts the ratchet and one thing that's really cool like once you start to get this all flushed out is you can see how like I don't have to worry about how the ratchet is retracting anymore because that functionality is all encapsulated within the ratchet class and I instantiated the ratchet so now I have a ratchet object that I can call a method on so it all like works together really nicely and I think that's one of the really cool things about robot programming is that you start to see like I don't know you're taught in class or you're taught in a book that this is the way object-oriented programming works but it's not until you actually maybe see the physical subsystem at least it wasn't for me that I really started to say like oh wow that's such a cool way to handle the problem because it kind of encapsulates all the complexity in one little area and then you can just interact with it in a nice interface so <laughs> that's my um, thoughts for going out um, on this one that object oriented programming is very cool especially when you're programming a big robot like this um, so next time we're going to be diving a little bit more into the robot code probably get into some autonomous see how that all goes We've been doing some teleop periodic and you seem pretty good with that, so let's uh, work on the autonomous next time. Um, hope to see you guys back and I hope that was helpful. Thank you.